Hi, welcome to my tutorial on how to um, encode or hard code subtitles in your 3D movies. So, you have a 3D movie like this. This is a sample. Let's open the open the DLC And as you can see, there are no subtitles whatsoever. It's going to okay. be. So, if you have Terrible. subtitle file and if it is an SRD file, what happens is that what I think, the subtitle will show like this, which is not suitable for 3D movies. You can use it, but it's not the best thing, best option. So, we are going to use four programs in a row. Okay. This one is to visualize the results. So, we will start by preparing the SRT file. First thing you have to do is to insert, and I'm assuming that the subtitle is synchronized with the video, insert before a subtitle. Let's write something, www, and you must get it as close to zero as possible. Okay, then you set the duration and you're done. So now let's save the file. Okay. Now let's use the 3D subtitle to convert this um, this SRT file into an IDX. Let's open it. We'll put it in the desktop. Um, if you have some special uh, characters in the uh, um, subtitle, then you should use the UTF-8, depending on your language. I'm going to use the Western European. Okay. Now, in what refers to the subtitles, I prefer the lightest, as light as possible, and I want also to have them in front of the screen, which means that they will stand out from the movie. Now, then I don't touch anything else except that I'm going to choose this option here so that I can get an IDX file. So, let's preview it. Check the input, this is the added subtitle, and let's convert it. Now this is rather quickly, if you have the, you can see the results here, down here. There are lots of tutorials, uh, tutorials on, on, uh, on this program, so I'm not going to make you lose more time with it. So you close it, and now you should have a 90x file, here it is. Okay? Next step, we are going to merge this file with the original video. So let's add, go to desktop, add the original, it's done. Let's add the subtitle IDX. This one. Okay. And we are going to max it and we will call it, let's say, maxed. Start maxing. It's a very fast step, and it's done. Okay, let's close. Now to the final step, we're going to use the handbrake. The handbrake. For the handbrake, you must import the maxed. Let's go to here. The maxed subtitles, the, the maxed video. Here it is. Open it. And we'll place it. Let's put it on the desktop. And we'll call it www final. Save it. Okay. Now the next step is to go to subtitles and see and choose the subtitle you want, which is the one you've uh, added and blended with the, the video. And then start and go. So this is a very lengthy pro process. And maybe you want to do it during the, the, the night while you're sleeping because it will take some hours to get ready. Okay, I'll be back soon. I'll, have, I'll leave it working for some time and be back to you with you soon. Okay. So the process is um, being finalized, 
uh, you can see here what is going on. And with this process, I don't get subtitles that flicker or fade away or have um, well any any problems. The only thing is that I cannot you cannot move them about. Okay, it was set to shut down. I don't want to shut down, so do nothing. There you go. Now you must have the final file, which is here, and so let, let's have a look at the result. Let's open it with. Where is it? see the plan. There we go. And as you can see, the subtitles are already there. Okay, that's it. So you've got your final result. Everything seems to be working. And now you have the 3D subtitles in your video. Okay, please leave a comment, a comment if you will. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye.